Hey YouTube, Kira Qualia here, bringing you all an update to my Card Ride Vanguard trade and sell binder for September 2022. Wanted to update the binders, I got some of the new stuff from the Shaman King title booster, along with some extra Record of Ragnarok cards for D format in the uh, binder, so I figured I'd update with everything that's changed from all the books as well. I have five binders to go through. The first two will be D format. The next one will be uh, V standard. The fourth one will be, uh, you know, stride format and the older formats. And then the last one, the yellow one, will be future card buddy fight. So if you're interested in any of the cards you see in any of the five books, you can message me on Facebook, Instagram, or email. I have all the contact information in the video description along with my wants list down there as well. If you want to make an offer on any of the cards you see in any of the binders you can message me on facebook instagram or email just like i stated if you want to purchase any of the cards i can do uh, paypal cash app facebook cash whatever is easier for you i know some people just prefer to buy the cards but if you're curious about what a specific card was or whether you know it had a specific rarity you can comment down below and i'll get back to you but if you want to make any offers make sure you do it with all the contact information that'll be down in the description just a lot more organized and easier for both of us that way so no one else can also comment here a few of the record of ragnarok cards along with some other uh hollow foils from sets four and five that's what's mostly in this red binder for d format some of the newer set cards the second binder or the next one will have cards mostly from sets one through three here's some more of the hollow foils some heel triggers as well from the festival collection some other record of ragnarok cards also on these pages i have some of the anna koyama promos from the uh, latest shaman king title booster as well and some other festival collection cards on these pages more of the heels also some of the promo starters for uh, black app and some other Record of Ragnarok uh, rares. Here's some Shaman King cards. Some of the extra stuff I have a lot for uh, Iron Maiden Jean, the X-Laws, uh, Shamash. Here's some other Ragnarok rares also. And don't have really much for how left, but here's some cards for Lyserg as well. Anna. And then a few of the over triggers also. And then on to the second binder. Like I said, this one will have mostly cards from sets one through three. So if there's anything you're looking for from those sets, it will most likely be in this binder. This one's also a little more organized than the first one. I definitely just have to organize all of them. Again, uh, since I go through the D format binders the most, they're the ones that end up just having, you know, the most taken out of and most disorganized because the cards change the most often from the most recent one and just from the ones I use the most because D format is what I play the most currently as well for Vanguard. But definitely excited for set six, but I figured I'd do a binder update before that set even comes out just to have everything ready to go. But yeah, there's a few set four cards in these binders, so maybe a chance that you may see some cards, like some of the triggers and whatnot that I just couldn't fit in the first binder in this binder. But once again, if you can't make out what a particular card is in any of the books, you can just message me down in the comment section below. But if you want to make an offer on any of the cards you see in any of the books, message me on Facebook, Instagram, or email. Definitely a lot more organized that way for both of us. Here are some of the promos and other hollow foils and rares from the first couple sets. Wanted to keep most of the higher rarity stuff at the beginning of the binder then just have some of the lower rarity stuff towards the end so that's it for the d format the next binder is v format so stuff like with the imaginary gifts and if you see a play set of a card more than likely i want to keep that play set together so just double check when you ask for any particular cards and i'll let you know uh, if i can end up moving them individually or if i want to keep them together uh, much easier that way just to ask and I'll let you know if there's like an additional card along with the playset then obviously I can move that one individual copy if it doesn't ruin the playset and as always uh, wants I'm looking for not really looking for too too much I'm open to look at binders and whatnot but like I said a lot of people just prefer to purchase cards they may see 
in any of the binders. A lot more easier that way because I normally will ship out the following day uh, just to be on top of it all. But yeah, a good amount of V format stuff still here as well. But really no organization to, you know, each individual clan. If I can just stick them somewhere, that's more than likely what I did with this binder. I know towards the end I'll have more of these starters and whatnot as well. But other than that, I was also finishing up all of the trades and sales from the previous binder, so that's normally a uh, hint to me to, you know, update them. Normally it's just a once a month thing now also. And like I said, I wanted to update them before I got to the new support from set six. Here are a few extra cards that just couldn't fit into the binder there. But next binder has all of these strides and stuff from the premium format. I have some of the, uh, one of the progenitor dragons. I have the Magellanica one here, along with the heat wave beast geomaglass as well. But some other strides, same rule with this binder and the other ones. If you see a playset, I more than likely want to keep the playset together, but I have a good amount of Bermuda triangle in these binders and some other random cards as well, heel triggers, but mostly strides that I just had from over the years because this was definitely the first binder that I ever put together. So a lot of pretty well-known cards in this book. And then, like I said, the yellow book will have future card buddy fight that I have for trader sale. Some Aqua Force, Dark Irregulars, Cold Paladins, Neo Nectar, plenty of stuff all over in this book as well. But if you can't see what a particular card may be, you can just comment down below with the time spot, and I'll get back to you on what that particular card may have been. Some Gear Chronicle on these pages, along with more heal triggers with skills, more strides, Nova Grapplers, some Cray Elemental cards, and more Bermuda Triangle on these pages as well. And looks like... Oh, sleeves fell out from somewhere. Uh, original deleter with the print on it for the clan symbol. And some Enigman helms as well. And then the final binder has future card buddy fight. So for a future card buddy fight, I am still looking for a few trades from this. So if you have any buddy fight cards, I definitely will trade for them. I know some people are trying to get out of the game still. Some people are trying to move their cards. So if you have anything for the game and you're curious about moving it, just let me know. I'll definitely be interested in taking a look at what you may have for trade. And can always trade Vanguard. And in any buddy fight that I may have towards some of those cards. I know it's getting a little more difficult to find some cards. So hopefully I have a few cards in my binder that some people are looking for because I'll probably feel the same way looking at someone else's binder just a card that's not as readily available but one I definitely may want to trade for got some stuff from Buddy Ragnarok some dark uh what was it Darkness Dragon World Star Dragon World but yeah a lot from Buddy Ragnarok and some of the ace cards as well so if you're looking for any of those cards like Gargantua Dragon definitely do have a good amount of them in these books as well so the last page is here also and that is it so once again if you saw anything in any of the books and you'd like to make an offer just send me a message and hopefully we can work something out and as always until next time please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and kira qualia out